Ford comes out in that beautiful Ford Ranger, leads them out, and we see Maddox Bailey, Christopher Polvardi, Maddox in the 29 MAV TV, Polvardi in the 94. He's in that Ford Optima Batteries VP Fuels machine. Braden Germani, we got Jer Jimmy Weitzel, we got Nathan Berry, Carson Adder, Hugo Reyes the third, Brody Engelston, and Mark Pinto. How awesome is this? There's Hugo. Yeah, coming a little bit slow to uh, to go right there. It's Hugo Reyes the third, the 92 machine. I think he was just hiking himself up right now. I think so too. Probably had a good lunch down there. <laughs> Why not? Good friend down there brought La Bufadora, their his trailer down, and uh, did some awesome tacos down there. Kind of bummed I wasn't able to make it. Darn it! <laughs> You're telling me, Dave. So 12 laps make up the distance here. Once again, Pro Lights on the track. Yeah, exciting morning too uh, for uh, Pulvorti, actually going over onto his hood. Oh yeah, that's something I don't see with Christopher too often. And uh, still two laps later, they got him uh, uprighted and uh, top qualifier. Yep, that's right. Version two, so just gonna find himself on the, on last the outside. Lap. Yeah. And of course, yeah, two inversion. So Maddox, the big winner yesterday, Paul Vardy looking for redemption, but keep an eye on Weitzel, Germani, Barry, Eder, Reyes, Angleston, and Pinto. Here we go. Optima Battery says, we're green, green, green. And the Believe Cam drones are up. Maddox Bailey out with an early lead. Bovardi tucks in behind with Weitzel. A couple of Toyo tire machines and a general tire machine. Yeah, good consistency out of uh, Maddox Bailey all weekend long, running up in the front. And uh, really, I think he's gone through maybe one set of tear-offs, if that. <laughs> well, that's when you get out front, you get to stay clean. Yeah, he certainly found a good way of doing it, but he does have his hands full in the way of Christopher Bovardi as uh, uh Oh. Thought he was going to step out for a second there. Ends up splitting off there. Bavardi the inside, Bailey in the outside line. Coming around, come out equal. Yeah, Jimmy always putting in a good show too here, sitting in third as he found himself in third yesterday. Red Cheramani, Nathan Berry. There's a 14 of Brody Angleston making his de de debut out there in the rent-a-ride. You hear that Ford horsepower in that thing. But there's the Stronghold Mav TV, Toyo Tire Machine, and Maddox Bailey, followed by the Ford-backed Optima Battery Machine there of Crystal Pulvardi. Great shots as they come around there. Look at them just sticking it sideways, hitting those bumps thing. That's just incredible. Yeah, and synchronization right there between those three drivers and a good gap between uh, the three of them as well. Uh, look to see if we can tighten this thing up here as we're just a couple laps in. And again, it's Bailey, Pulvardi, Weitzel, Chiramonte, Barry, Eder, Pinto, Reyes the third, and Eggleston. Great view right there out of the Mav TV machine, out of Maddox Bailey. Jeremiah just goes across the stripe there. There's Nathan Berry, that CBR Empire machine. Carson Edder, the Prado. I'm here in cheers 
great shot there from the back of that Atma Batteries machine of Paul Vardy. Love seeing them back it in. Keeping that hook up. All three go to the inside line and that split. Eight laps will remain after this time by. Love to see them just popping those things sideways off the jumps. Yeah, just setting up. Yeah. Getting the car all. Get the rotate. Yep, yeah. then they pop it in. It's just a straight shot when they go out of the turn. Crowd loving the action here. Hear the roar of these V8s. Great shot again from the Believe Cam up top. Getting all the great action. Go to the wide shot there. The Believe Cam, because everybody else can't believe the visual that they get here. They're That's exactly team. right. Insane. You better believe. Of course, you bet as the actually the last name of the pilot out there in the Believe Cam, you better believe. Great shots there, the Stronghold Engineering, Map TV, Lucas Oil Machine there, Toyo tires underneath them. Boulevardi also uh, steal it on there as well as with Angle in driving that car. There goes Mark Pinto, the number 17. Here comes our leaders again, man. They are so quick. Some competition yellow this time by here for these drivers. Bailey in a great drive right now. 51.383, only bested there by uh, Christopher Pavardi, the 51.212. So uh, still some close times. Pavardi a little bit quicker that last time around, huh? Let's see how it's going to go. And then you go back to Weitzel. He ran with a 52.236. So not really off the pace at all. So we re-racked, re-stacked. So it's Bailey, Christopher Paul Vardy, and Jimmy Weitzel Jr. Great shot back there, the back of Christopher's truck. As you look back on Jimmy Weitzel, you can read that gentle tire sticker right on there. Optimum batteries at Ford Ranger. Throwing old glory on it with Optimum Batteries flag waving high. Looking to the run to the checkered flag here, John. Yeah, just in the closing laps here for our Pro Life main event. And we have one more main event to go, the Pro 2 for main event 14 Ooh. on the schedule for our doubleheader this weekend. We uh, again thank everybody for tuning in at home on the live track feed that we have going on. And uh, of course, we couldn't do it without all our wonderful staff and crew, all of our sponsors for making this happen as uh, we're back under green here. So Maddox Bailey leads us down into turn number one. So uh, if it's any time, this would be the time here for Borbordi and or Weitzel to uh, capitalize and make some moves here on our leader who's been in continuous domination, I feel like, all weekend long. Yeah, one of the things about this class, they run DOT tires, same thing you run on the road, off-road tires. So it's really great to see how they all perform out there. A couple of Toyos, we've got General out there. Incredible. Bailey, Bolvardi not giving him breathing room, nor is Weitzel. Weitzel trying to throw it in. He's going to go to the outside split. Bailey and Bolvardi to the inside. Yeah, if there was ever an opportunity, now would be the one. 
for both of those drivers to uh, try to get to the front end and or even uh, switch each other's positions right now between yep. Bordy and Weitzel. And then Sheremani kind of just in the distance right there, waiting to see what happens as he sits in fourth. And of course, it's a, it's a new one for Sheremani out there for sure. How about Nathan Berry in a brand new Pro Light? We've held a brand new stab that truck there now, Liam. Look at that ballet, these Pro Lights we see just rotating around the corner. Love how the front ends just hug the front, then the back end just comes around and things just keep going. So Mad Max out front. Mr. Cool, Christopher Povardi in second there. Yeah, a good even gap here actually back in even to the sixth, seventh position out on the track now. Held up by Eggleston right now in that number seven spot. Really, you know, knowing these kids for so long and watching them, I mean, just to see how calm, cool, collected they are. You know, even driving out there, they keep their head about them. I think that's one of the reasons they excel so well. Both Maddox, Christopher, and Jimmy. Great Germani, you know. So much experience with these kids coming out of trophy carts. They've been driving already for like 10 years. Yeah, well, it shows right now. Yep. Certainly a talented bunch of them come across the flag stand. Complete another lap. Ah, Christopher got out there a little bit of the marbles, lost the momentum. So it looks like two laps remaining. And the number 14 of Angleston gets off course, gets back on and running. We're going to see that white flag. Look at this. Look how close they are, Paul Barney and Bailey. Bailey had to get on the binders there not to get into Bailey. Set up here early on to the corner. Let's see He's if going high. Yep. Yeah. Going wide to get that inside line. Using up every bit of this track here is your second place driver, the 94 of Christopher Provorti. Smooth as fast, they say. There's the white flag. One more lap to go. See that living loud kicker sticker on top of uh, Christopher's with. Keying in. Oh! I believe that drone just got taken out by some roost. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I saw that thing flip out into the... Uh... Oh, look at this battle going on! Bovardi to the inside! Bailey! Now the inside line coming up. Bovardi to Bailey. Door to door action. Here we go! The right-hander. 180 degrees around. Bailey! Bovardi! Bailey! Will he go to the outside? No, he tries to stick to the inside. Cuts the line off of Paul Vardy. Oh, pushes him there off the back end. <laughs> this is going to be a photo finish. They got to get back on the track. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. What an incredible finish. Talk about bringing a show to you folks. They just did it. Wow. I can't wait. And I know Weitzel was up there in the third spot. So Jimmy Weitzel gets on the podium. But what a finish with Bailey and Bovardi. You know those kids are having a good time. So we're definitely going to send uh, John down to hear this story for sure.
showing it right there, the Madman, Maddox Bailey. Man, these two drivers putting on a show, and uh, man, way to stay cool. Coming into that final corner right there for Maddox Bailey, gonna take home the win and sweep the weekend here over Jimmy Weitzel in third, and Christopher Pavorty in a hell of an effort there on that final lap to uh, put a charge in and put on a show for all of us here. So big congratulations going out to those drivers. We'll let them uh, get their helmet off, get the emotions run out of them, and uh, we'll get them on the podium here in just a moment. Pavorty and the Madman, your winner here, Maddox Bailey, come on up to the podium. Jimmy, I like it. Yeah, we're all going to come up on up here. Did you see what you had going on in front of you, or are you just focused on your own race? What do you think, Jimmy? Uh, it was pretty cool. Uh, watching these guys battle, they were going pretty gnarly. I had started to get close to them over there, and then I almost clipped Pavorty, and I had a slam on the brakes right there. Didn't want to cause too much damage on us, but, uh, but yeah, it was, a, it was a cool race. You know, I tried to hang in there, and these guys were, they had some speed today, and, you know, I was trying to find find some lines. You know, it's kind of spinning a little too much, and, um, you know, go back to the drawing board and uh, figure out what we can do. Yeah, who's going to help you uh, draw on that board here next time we see you? Uh, you know, it's my mom and dad, uh, General Tire, of course, Ultra Wheels, Fox Shocks, SDG, Dynamic Motorsports, uh, San Diego Laser Cutting, you know, my girlfriend, of course. Um, you know, anyone that cheered me on on the live stream, you know, thank you guys. There's a lot of them. Jimmy White, so congratulations to you taking home that third spot. Moving on down here to a... Showman putting in a charge here on those closing laps, just not enough. Uh, tell us what it was like coming into the, those final few corners. And actually, you had gotten into the lead here for down in turn three. Tell us about that. Yeah, no, I, I just all weekend been struggling to turn it on just till the end. So we put on the, the charge right there at the end and, you know, got up next to him. But it, it's a tough track to make it stick. So overall, a uh, great weekend of racing. I'm just excited to be back racing with, uh, you know, we got a little bit of fans and this awesome new series. Great to have you out here. Who would you like to thank in closing? I know you got a lot of partners behind you. No, yeah, I couldn't thank it. so many people to get up here. This Ford Performance Ranger, so much fun. Optima batteries, steal it. Kicker Audio, Vision Wheels, Toyo Tires. It's been such a great season. My whole crew, and uh, shout out to all the racers for coming out and playing this weekend. And the crew at KTM wanted, or at k and wanted to give you a little something, $150 to, for your efforts right there. Uh, Maddox, wow, you came under fire on the closing lap. Uh, tell us what it was like here, especially in that final corner. You got everybody out of the seat, and you held strong like a true professional. Tell us about that. Um, yeah, you know, I was expecting the, the come on from Chris, the whole race, you know, and, uh, <laughs> You know, it it really comes down to who has the most endurance and who's going to push it the hardest. And today, I was the one that pushed it the hardest. And I'm I'm glad to be standing up here on this box. I'm just glad to be racing in general. How how confident are you going into rounds three and four at Glen Helen, uh, having swept the weekend here? Um, I mean, there's a little bit of confidence, but you know, I I like to stay humble and I I like to drive, and that's that's the best thing about it. So. Uh, <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm pretty stoked and hopefully we have fun at round three and four. Who are the people that you're stoked to have in your corner? Uh, my mom, my dad, uh, Matt, Jimmy, Chad Matag, uh, Chad Graham, uh, my Lola, my pop-up, uh, Mav TV, Lucas Oil, Toyo Tires, everyone that comes out to support me and everyone that sponsors me. Thank you. I wouldn't be here without you. The humbled madman right here, Maddox Bailey. Taking home the win in, uh, man, what was probably one of the craziest races that we've seen here all afternoon. And again, we want to thank you guys for putting on quite the show there in our Pro Light main event. Jimmy Weitzel, big congratulations to you in third once again. 
Christopher Pavardi in that second spot, putting on a charge at the end, but the victor right here, Pro Light. Two-time winner here, sweeping the weekend, Maddox Bailey. Looks like some track prep going on in between. And uh, again, man, we're gonna send it up to you, Dave. One final race here to uh, cap off round number two here for the Great American Short Course Racing Series powered by our friends at Optima Batteries. Well, I don't know, but these Pro 2s are gonna have to step their game up to contend with that. What an incredible race.